Hey guys, welcome back. It's James from Brick It Out. And look where I am today. I decided to come back to the Lego store. So, I'm gonna run in here. They don't look too busy at all. I'm gonna run in here and let you know what all I can uh, find inside here. We've got the Coliseum out here. This is the Lego store in Tyson's Corner. There's the Ninjago Gardens there. That's a nice set. Oh, there's the um, Medieval Black Shop. That's a pretty cool set. We'll run inside here and uh, I'll get right back with you guys and let you know what all we get. Okay, guys. We just left the Lego store. We're heading back to the car. And... Uh, we're going to head home and then we'll get back with you guys and let you see what all we got from the Lego store. Wasn't as much as I wanted, but hey, anytime you get Lego, it's a good day. Hey guys, we're back from the Lego store. So we got a few sets here we want to show you. Oh, by the way, don't forget to check out our 500 subscriber giveaway video. There's a link in the description uh, below that will show you, will take you to the video, that way you can see the rules of how to get entered in. Um, we can't wait to get to that 500 subscriber milestone because we're gonna have more giveaways to come in the future, even bigger ones as well, so please check that out. All right, let's show you the goodies we got at the Lego store. First one is the Mickey and Minnie Mouse buildable characters, set number 43179. 1,739 pieces. It is an 18 plus set, which is a new creator expert. And this is a set that I've had my eye on personally for a while. Uh, they're just really big. I mean, from what I've seen pictures of and other uh, YouTubers that's done reviews on this set, they're definitely really big. It retails for $179.99 here in the United States. This is definitely a, gonna be a, def a good high collectible set for people, especially if you like Minnie and Mickey Mouse. The Disney. Here's the back of it here. I love how it has the little camera and uh, his little banjo or guitar. I love With, their Polaroid, their picture book. Oh it's yeah, awesome. that's really like neat. Polaroids. So yeah, so definitely pick one of these up if you guys can see them. 180 bucks is definitely not bad here in the United States. Alright, let's get into the second thing. Set number 76153. The Avengers Helicarrier. Now, this is a set we missed out on the first one, and we would have loved to have got the first one, I think, from 2014 or sometime in that area. Don't quote me on that. I'm sure you guys would know. But uh, the really big one, we would have loved to have got that. Now it's like $600 to buy that on the aftermarket. But this retails for $119.99 USD, 1,244 pieces. Uh, it comes with eight minifigures, so that's a good set there. Definitely smaller than the first one, but for that price, the price is a lot smaller too. There's the back of the box there. It shows you different scenes and stuff. Only has the two bad guys. You've got one of the AIM guys and then MODOK. Uh, the rest is all, uh, I mean, they're attacking the Avenger Helicarrier, so you'd have more good guys there, I would think, than bad guys, but, but yeah, that's a, that's a pretty cool set. Can't wait to build that. All right. Uh, another set we got, the next set is set number 71380. This is the second wave of the Super Mario sets. This is Master Your Adventure, 366 pieces. Um, really cool set. Uh, if you guys are a big fan of Super Mario Brothers, like most people are, um, this is definitely childhood memories here. So uh, nostalgic. <laughs> exactly. We got most of the first series sets. Uh, it's just so hard to figure out where to put them with dealing with the limited room we have for now. Uh, there's the back of the box there. I guess this is kind of like the starter kit, kind of, for series two. It's not really a starter kit, but it's, it's a, you know, you can build it how you want. You can add it to the first series. So that's pretty cool. All right. And then the last set, this is the set we've been, Lego has had our name on hold for this next set for almost four months now. It has consecutively been out of lego.com for almost four months. It's hard to find in a Lego store. 
Lego has not released it to any other store, so we don't know what store it would actually be exclusive, if it or if it's just going to be at Lego shop or the Lego stores. But this set is something we were very excited to get. Once we got the call, we drove in the car today, flew down there, and picked the set up, and then we picked up the other three while we were there. Because you know you can't go into a Lego store and only get one set. <laughs> I mean that's just, that's a, that should be a crime right there. Okay. All right, last and final set is Lego set number 75292, the Razor Crest. This is a set that we have had our eye on for a while, and it's, like I said, consecutively out of stock everywhere. Um, we're actually about ready to start watching these seasons, the yeah, series. Yeah, the Mandalorians. Yeah, we've, believe it or not, we have actually haven't watched any of the seasons yet. I think season three just came out. Yeah, so we're going to binge watch two. that. Exactly. <laughs> So there's the back of the box. And I've seen this set built down at the Lego store. And surprisingly, look at the size of the ship compared to the minifigures. That's a good size set there. It's really nice. So we were really happy to get this. So I'll try to get them all out here where you can see them. Got the Razor Crest. Put the Minnie and Mickey back there. The Helicarrier. And the uh, Super Mario. So, definitely not a bad haul. Wish we would have got more, but they really didn't have a lot of stuff in stock that we wanted, uh, that we didn't already have. But these, this is definitely a good, good Lego haul. So, uh, please like, share, and subscribe. Again, please don't forget to enter that 500 subscriber giveaway. Don't miss out on that. We'll definitely have more giveaways to come. Thank you guys very much for watching. You guys be safe. Please leave comments below. We love to read any comments you guys leave. Guys, have a great night, stay safe, and we'll see you guys on the next one.